Happy Tuesday, everyone. I hope you had a lovely weekend. I'm Stella Chung, and in today's Compete Fix, we've got news on League of Legends seeing the end of adding new champions to the game, Kefri getting kicked from a $100,000 CSGO tournament after being accused of cheating, and Project L will most likely not be seen with any updates at EVO. We've got a lot to cover, so let's jump right into it. League of Legends, one of the top MOBA games since its release in 2009, has been constantly pumping out content, including new champions. There was no end seen to the content being pushed out to League, especially with it only continuing to grow in popularity after the KDA collection. However, Riot dev Matt Lung Harrison confirmed that the final League champion is coming soon. In an interview on the League podcast Broken by Concept, Lung Harrison stated that the League squad is already considering an endpoint where the roster will stop adding new champions. For context, there are 161 champions currently in League, which is a lot. However, he did state that the final champion would release when Riot can no longer add intuitive characters and that they still have a lot to flex before they reach that point. The Riot development team will be creating new champions along with balancing previous ones, so we don't have to worry about the end of new champions yet. Though, honestly, how many more interesting characters can you add after 161? Staying with Riot, the announced fighting game Project L is set in the world of Runeterra and it finally got an update out to fans after a long time of silence. Project lead Tom Cannon confirmed that the game will be free to play at launch and will include Ilawi as a playable character. In the Dev Diary post, Cannon detailed that he was leaving to attend EVO and that there is a very slim potential for any sort of reveal during the tournament by saying there will be an update out later this year. Project L was originally revealed live at EVO 2019, but unfortunately this year's EVO will most likely not feature any further updates on Project L. However, Canon did say there would be another update before the end of the year, so there's still time for a bigger reveal. There was a bit of drama in the pro esports scene on Twitter this weekend as ex-Overwatch pro Kefri was accused of cheating in a $100,000 Counter-Strike Global Offensive Tournament. The tournament was the Ready Up Invitational where the point system was based off of individual skill instead of the team's overall points. The highest scoring individuals will be vying for the grand prize. The point system awarded one point for a kill, two points for an assist, and five points for a knife kill. Now, in CSGO, audio is everything because you can hear a player running up behind you and a knife kill requires you to be extremely close to an enemy in order to get the actual melee damage off. One of the participants, Gale, ended up getting three knife kills, a total of 15 points on Kefri, and Kefri also got two knife kills on Gale. A clip was posted on Twitter by Jake Lucky where Gale was able to easily knife Kefri that instantly made everyone suspicious. Kefri tweeted to Jake saying he genuinely did not hear Gale behind him, but it remained suspicious that the same two players would be getting knife kills on each other. Face It investigated the situation and deemed Kefri innocent, but he was still removed from the tournament due to overall complaints. However, the community and tournament participants are demanding an additional follow-up to conclude the tournament findings. How do you feel about League seeing the future end of champion releases? Also, do you think Kefri was teaming or do you just think he got lucky? Let us know. Now that you're all caught up on the news, be sure to check out our IGN first for this month with our exclusive reveal on the first 16 minutes of gameplay for Gotham Knights. For more gaming and esports news, be sure to stay tuned right here on IGN every Tuesday for your Compete Fix. See you then.